so here I'm going to talk about a difference amplifier two voltage sources V1 and V2 are here this is V1 here and this is V2 and these are the resistances so we'll see how this can act as a difference amplifier so this points voltage is of course VA this one so the current that comes here goes this way and we can apply no current goes into the ter input terminals of course in input pins so this current is zero so this current will be this current so if we apply KCL here at this point we can see that V1 minus VA over R1 will be VA minus V0 over R4 so this current is VA minus V0 over R4 like that so we'll just rearrange this one it will become VA 1 plus R1 plus 1 plus R4 and here it is V0 over R4 so I can write V0 here over R4 on the left hand side I'm bringing so it's becoming V1 plus R1 1 plus R4 minus V1 over R1 or V0 is VA write R1 here it's becoming R1 R4 R1 plus R4 times R4 and minus V1 R1 times R4 so of course VA here R1 R1 plus R4 minus V1 R4 over R1 like that so this is from using writing KCL at this point and writing KCL at this point will give us what we'll see on the next page so V2 minus VB will over R2 V2 minus VB over R2 will be equal to so that is this one VB over R3 VB over R3 so that gives me V2 over R2 is equal to VB 1 plus R2 plus R1 plus R3 and if I rearrange this one it becomes VB becomes R2 R3 R2 plus R3 times R2 here so this is getting cancelled it's becoming VB R2 plus R3 over R3 or I can write it like this 1 plus R3 over R2 so this is VB now VA is equal to VB so what we can do here instead of VA if I go there I can write VB is equal to V2 over 1 plus R2 over R3 that I can write so I will get rid of V and VBs there so here I can rewrite this one I will erase this part so that I can do it in this page so V0 is becoming VA instead of VA VA is VB so instead of VB I will write V2 over 1 plus R2 over R3 if that is that's what it was and this one is of course on top this is 1 plus R4 over R1 and this is becoming V1 which is R4 over R1 
what I will do, I will take R4 over R1 out on the top. So this is becoming V2 here. And this one will just change to R1 over R4. So this one remains 1 and this one becomes just 1. And this is 1 plus R2 over R3. And this is becoming R4 over R1, V1. Now, if we make the ratio R1 over R4 is equal to R2 over R3, then what happens? This part, um, this part, this part and this part becomes equal. So we get something like R4 over R1. So these two gets cancelled then because they are equal. V2 minus V1. So with this, if we can maintain this ratio in the register values, we get this difference amplifier. And we are saying it's different and difference amplifier. Basically, we need to have this ratio because uh, if V2 and V2 is equal to V1, we have to have V0 is equal to 0. That is important. So if the difference value is 0, we need the output should be 0 for it to be a difference amplifier. So we need this thing. And as a result, we get V0. Oh, sorry, this one. Oh, this one is V0. Or V0 is becoming R4 over R1 times this one. Now, if we make R4 is equal to R1, if R1 is equal to R4, then we get a subtractor. And otherwise, if we want to make it as an amplifier, we can select the ratio. Like if R1 is 10K, R4 is like 100K, then we get 10 times ampli amplification and so on. And if they, we make them equal, like R1 is equal to R4, we get a subtractor. And when R1 is equal to R4, of course, R2 will be also equal to R3 and they, they, all of them will be the same. Because this part will become 1, and so R2 is equal to R3 and they are the same value. 